um, to show you how to add crux to your photo in Photoshop. So here we have a picture of a wall that I talked um, out and about yesterday. Um, all it was was just on the side of someone's house, the wall had cracks. These can make fabulous textures for adding to pictures. And what I'm going to show you now is a really cool effect where you can add a crack to another picture so it can make another wall that isn't cracked look like it's cracking. So here we have um, the self-portrait that I took um, on the same day um, and I decided that I wanted to add some cracks to the wall. So I've already done some which um, you can see here, they're very faint. But what I want to do now is add some that are a little bit more contrasty. So those cracks were good, but I'm going to go back and I'm going to add some better ones. So here we go. I put the picture of the cracks um, on top of the picture of me. And the way we're going to get it to blend in is to go into, uh, you double click on layers. And then what we're going to do is you see these sliders over here, um, we're going to hold down the Alt key um, and we're going to slide one to the left, um, too far, bear with me, it could be the white one, I it's keep getting mixed up with which one it is, and then slide the white one, nope, that was the wrong order, okay, so actually it was slide this white one here. All the way here, all the way down here, maybe not so much, and then slide the black one over. And now I'm going to just press OK and zoom in, see what that's like on and off. Yes, that works. OK, so as you can see my face has now got a bit of cracks on it but we don't want that and this is where the mask comes into play so i've already got a mask on this um but what i'm actually going to do is i'm going to delete that mask and i'm going to circle i'm going to take my lasso and i'm just going to because i only want let's see i just want like this bit of a crack so i'm going to you know just circle around it and then I'm going to copy it, um, com copy and then paste onto a new layer. Now I'm going to get rid of this. And actually sometimes, um, I forgot that this happens, that the effect we just did where I showed you how it blended in um, has gone. And so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to repeat it again um, with a white one confused ah yes it was okay and then a little bit of black and there we go and so now what we're going to do is with the layer we are going to then add we're going to add um using the mask sorry if you can hear the door bell in the background we're going to paint it away and as you can see now we have a crack in the wall so I'm not going to do this properly, um, but as you can see now, it's really blending into the wall. And um, if I just rub out a little bit more here, so you can get the idea. But there you go. That is how you add paint away a bit more. You want to use a soft brush, 100% opacity on black, painting on black on the mask. But as you can see now, it is blended into the wall, and that's how we have. So, okay, so thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Can't wait to show you the real image, the finished image. And thank you for watching my first edited video.